right, so here I have this Amazon box. We're going to open her up. And see what's inside. Got some packing paper. And a smaller box. Tape. All right, so what we actually have are two, um, uh, not stainless steel, but um, brush nickel uh, shower curtains. So in here are going to be the end caps, and then we have the shower curtains that can be adjusted. I'm actually using this because we took the doors off of my daughter's uh, closet and she just wants curtains hung up and not the sliding doors. So what I'm going to do is put these caps on either end of this curtain rod or shower curtain and then we're going to actually use it for her closet um, hang, uh, to hang her curtains. Now this is a two pack. I only need one. So we'll have another one for if we need to replace our shower curtain. Um, and uh, so the length here is adjustable and all you do is just twist and it pulls uh, uh, out further. So depending on the length or the width of your opening, whether it's your shower or if you're going to use it for a closet or doorway you can adjust the width of this rod and then you're just going to put one end up against the wall and put it as tight as you can on the other side so that the curtain doesn't fall down um, either out of the shower or um, down a doorway or a closet so anyway i will show you what it looks like once we get her curtains hung up Okay, so I threaded her grommet curtains through the rod and then just prepped the um, rod up to the edges of the uh, closet doorway and then twisted the opposite direction to tighten the rod as best as I could in the spot and then hung the curtains. So now a shower curtain rod becomes a closet rod for curtains, a curtain rod for the closet. So thanks for watching and hopefully you enjoyed this video.